All right, today we're gonna to make a frame for mounting uh, plates. Um, you can mount plates, mirrors, or even a uh, picture frame. Put glass and, and a mat and everything in it. I'll show you how to do that. Okay, once it, uh, once it sets up, just go ahead and route, true it up. All right, once you get it, get it trued up and it's round, we'll go ahead and uh, come in on the face of it here. My uh, calipers don't open up uh, quite wide enough for it, so I'm just going to check it with with uh, the plate I want to put in it. So. Once you get the diameter right, just go ahead and uh, and check the depth gauge. This one's going down a little bit. You know, make sure that's right so it sits in there flush. And then we're going to put a lip on the inside. And I'll bring the camera in and show you that. This is a little bit different than uh, making a, the mirror compact. Set on it. Just go ahead and uh, come in. Probably a quarter of an inch. And then, then, so you leave a, an in, uh, lip in there and clean this out. So that whatever it is, whether you uh, are putting a plate in here or, or, uh, or you want to do a picture, that way the glass and the mat and you know, have something to rest up in here. This is our uh, diameter of the plate. The plate we're going to put in here. Then this is the lip that where it'll the face of it will rest against that. And then we're going to go straight in here and then come in from the side here and part it off. And that way we'll leave a little bit of waste here, and we can use that to remount it and uh, and turn the face of it. But that's what I mean about leaving uh, leaving the lip here. And then we'll go ahead and sand up the whole back side just like we do do on uh, the compact and uh, then go ahead and we'll go and probably go in a little bit deeper here and then come in from the side I'm gonna come around here I'm not gonna leave it this this the rim this wide or the edge of the frame I'm so I'm gonna bring it around and then we'll we'll come in right about here so that we can uh, cut it off and then still use this to remount it
Once you get, get it the basic shape, we'll go ahead and sand up this side and finish that off and spin it around. Just go ahead and run through your grits again and, and finish it off. Finish up with uh, your grits so that it's completely done. And we'll part it off and put it, mount it back on. And even uh, sand in here and then the, the inside lip here too. Even though we're going to actually be working on that part of it when we mount it back on, you can't get the, the very the edge down in here. And then all of them. Probably just go ahead and use the axe off. Once you get it parted off, we're going to go ahead and uh, turn this down and then mount it back on. But this this will be the back side of it. So. Clean up the, the face of it. Once you get it all cleaned up, just go ahead and uh, sand it and finish it. Um, you notice I had to put a little bit of tape on it. I got a little carried away when I was bringing that down to size. Out. Just lay it in there, run a bead of glue around it, or they uh, they make some push pins for if you were putting a picture in it. And there you go, you're ready to uh, mount up your collection of Elvis plates or uh, make some pictures.